Speaking of AI, I'm curious as to like, you've been, you've been doing marketing for 20 years in the past year or two, what do you see has changed or is in the process of changing when it comes to marketing, uh, with a lot of the changes that we've seen with generative AI and what are you excited about next? I'm not sure what's actually changed. I think it's an interesting viewpoint, but <clears throat> I see a lot of experimentation, which I think is good. And I see a lot of potential here. I keep coming back, however, to thinking about the old adage that people massively overestimate a technology's impact in the short term and underestimate it in the long term. And just like when computers came into marketing and business overall, I think AI is a tool like that that's coming in. And I don't think we've even thought about the real long-term potential impacts, especially on the, the business side um, to, to doing, to working in an AI environment, like the, the computing environment. In the short term, I think it's really interesting to see people experimenting with generating ideas for content from AI and then doing the writing after the fact, coming up with their own ideas and having AI help them edit for clarity or length or chopping and changing it for different content formats. I think the proliferation of AI into analytics and helping people understand a lot better what is actually working and what those potential impacts are going to be. So the forecasting side of, of analytics, um, I think those things are all going to change um, in ways that we haven't really thought of yet. But I, you know, the, I look at it again as a tool, much like the computer that helped us get more efficient. And I think, once we go through this experimental phase early on, I think we're going to settle down into another tool that's going to make us at least that order of magnitude more efficient, just like computers did when they rolled in.